Mistislav Chernov. Sutradara sekaligus jurnalis asal Ukraina membagikan pengalamannya membuat dokumenter 20 Days in Mariupol. Dokumenter 20 Days in Mariupol itu memperlihatkan rekaman-rekaman di Ukraina pada awal perang Rusia-Ukraina. 11 investigasi besar telah dilakukan Chernov dan timnya selama satu tahun. Chernov adalah salah satu jurnalis internasional terakhir yang ada di Mariupol waktu pasukan Rusia menyerang kota itu. Oh, I have to be frank with you. There are so many moments that didn't make in a film because I were afraid and I didn't film them. I saw them with my eyes, but I either was hiding from the bombs or I was just running for my life. So uh, I am afraid all the time, really. Chernov bercerita detik-detik ketika dia dan timnya akan keluar dari Mariupol. Saat akan keluar dari kota, seorang pembuat film asal Lituania tertangkap oleh pasukan Rusia. Chernov takut hal yang sama bakal terjadi pada dirinya. Chernov makin was-was karena dia dan timnya sudah dicap sebagai teroris informasi oleh Rusia. Gak hanya itu, Chernov juga harus melewati hari-hari dengan menyaksikan hujan bom Rusia di depan matanya langsung. We all understand how Mariupol, how important Mariupol was. We all understand how this coverage was important. Again, because it, for a lot of people across the world, it opened eyes on, on what this invasion really was. That it really wasn't a targeted specific military objects. It was a barrage of indiscriminate fire that killed thousands of people and still killing thousands of people. And That was the moment when the world realized that that's how it is. We left Mariupol and I kept working on the front lines. I came back to my hometown, I'm from Kharkiv, and I, I covered it for months and months and months for, for AP News. And uh, it, was, uh, it was very hard to do because you can actually see people being killed in front of your house where you grew up. One day I came to a house where I lived as a student and there were three people killed by by a russian shell just in front of the entrance uh, my school got bombed so all that all that makes it very personal uh, and at the same time uh, gives you the energy to to keep working to keep filming Chernov senang waktu tahu audiens dokumenter 20 Days in Mariupol disaksikan banyak masyarakat. Karya Chernov itu pun akhirnya menyabet penghargaan Pulitzer layanan publik. Chernov menyatakan dia ingin membuat dokumenter kedua dari 20 Days in Mariupol.